there are those of you who wonder repeatedly, continuously, how you may help heal the planet. You wonder, are you even healers? Or are you just flotsam in the cosmic jet stream? We are here to tell you that you are indeed healers and much more extraordinary than your very tiny enclosed human mind can comprehend. We have said this before and we say it again and we'll keep saying it. But this is all right because we have contracted at this point in human existence to share this message many times and we are comfortable with this obligation. You You designed your life because you are an eternal being who wishes to have an experience. So you have the ability to design your life from inside it, not just from creation before life. You may design your life at any time. Think every night you go to sleep and you dream. When you awaken, many of you do not even remember the dreams you had, but you know that you did dream because that is what you do. So when you are in life, you are the dream of your eternal soul, but you do not remember what your eternal soul dreamed up. So you are caught between two dreams, the dreams of your subconscious and the dreams of your overconscious. And you are in the middle, possibly very confused and feeling alone and alienated, isolated even by yourselves. This can be an overwhelming feeling we understand. We encourage you to daydream, to fantasize. This is a wonderful, simple technique to help you connect with your dream self and the dream given to you from your pure self. If you do not recall your dreams, then you are not lucidly dreaming. To develop the skill to lucidly dream is a wonderful starting point to develop the skill to then co-create with your soul. Even though you are in life, you are still the master of your command you may still design and delegate and redistribute energy and realities as you wish. So we will discuss in greater detail in our longer sessions the process and techniques of this. However, we encourage you now to start with fantasizing and daydreaming and allowing your daydream to fill your heart and your spirit in your body so that this may feel like a wonderful reality, not in place of the one around you, but in accord with it. And then we will, for now, just have fun, do not worry. And we will share with you techniques how to use this skill to then recraft the reality around you to meet the reality of your imaginings. In the beginning, you will not necessarily replace it, but you will impact it, affect it. When you fill your imaginings 
with fantasies that make you happy in a joyous, kind, loving way, then you are also sending this energy out to the world and you are sending healing energy into self. And what happens is your energy of self can become stronger and stronger until your imaginings very naturally spill out to the world. If you are imagining that you are back in time, you may actually be connecting with a past life or a time in your planet when there were certain skills or abilities that wish to connect to now. Think how powerful that will be when you make this connection and bring skills that have been lost to the present where they are needed. Do not, if you also fantasize you are with fairies in a garden, you are help bringing the fairy energy closer to the now. If you dream you are in the stars, you are bringing cosmic energy to the here and now. If you dream you are a very successful healer, you open yourself to become a very benevolent, loving, successful healer. That which you dream, you can forge into reality. So we implore you, do not sit in despair and loneliness, for that is what you are creating for yourself. Not that you blame yourself for where you're at. You learn and you grow. If you are alone, it is your choice what you do with this time. And we encourage you to bring in fantasies of happy frequency on up to the highest divine and allow them in time to replace whatever else is there that is below that frequency for no reason other than it will be an enjoyable experience. And we encourage this. We will speak further of this in greater detail another time, but this is a good first step for you to become the manifester in the team of manifestors for your new world and your new life. We thank you and we wish upon you every blessings you could ever hope for times infinity.